This channel does not promote or encourage any illegal activities. All contents provided by this channel is meant for educational purpose only. Welcome back, everyone. As you know, when GitHub banned my two accounts, many people faced a lot of problems. They also struggled to find Ghost, as you can see in the comments here. So now I've created a new version that you can easily find and use. Let's get started open your browser. Now click on bio and you will find a Terabox link there. Simply click on it. So now you're on the Terabox site. If you're not logged in, log into your account there. Then click on tool market. When you enter, you will see a Windows software folder click on it. After that, scroll down and select ghost. Finally, click save to Terabox, then click the view button. Okay, this is your Terabox storage. Simply select the ghost file again and click the download button. Okay, wait a moment and it will be done. Now let's go to the file. There is our downloaded zip file. Extract the zip file. Um, I will delete the zip file then. Then open the folder. As you can see, there is a password inside. So first I will copy the password. Now open ghost. If any window pops up, simply click more info. Then click run anyway. Okay, now I will paste the password here. So our tool is now open, and you can see a new version of the interface. It looks very cool. I will ask, who are you? And you will see the result. Let's clear the chat, and now let's try something about Wi-Fi hacking. So I'll ask it about how to hack Wi-Fi, and you can see how it responds. It provides a tool related to Wi-Fi hacking. So I check the code, and it looks exactly like a full tool. Now let's clear the chat and try asking about how to hack a site and dump his database, and once again, once again, the response is visible. As you can see, it generates content related to viruses and SQL injection, which could be adapted for creating custom tools or testing scenarios. Now click save code, and you can save your code and chat wherever you want. Let's save it and I'll show you. Now minimize the tool and verify whether the file has been saved successfully. As you can see, all data has been saved properly. Okay guys, I hope everything is clear now for those who called me a virus or fake. I hope they can see everything here. Thanks for watching show some love and support and share your new trading ideas that made it possible for me to create this. See you soon with a new interesting tool and video.